activity from the Asari military against the Reapers. Come on. You know how Asari work. Infiltration and sabotage. But against Reaper forces, that's... I know. About as useful as tits on a Hanar. Good thing we've got the Turians and the Krogan to do the heavy lifting. Our people just aren't built for the front ranks. Krogan. Yes, I'm aware of that. So, that makes you a quarter Krogan. That's not how it works. I'm a thousand years old. I've had kids with Hanar. Don't tell me how Asari reproduction works. Wait, I have a half-sister who's part Hanar. I thought that wasn't how it worked. All I'm saying is it Feel the urge to headbutt something, it's genetic. I have never wanted to headbutt anything. Really? Not even a little bit? Come on. I do not headbutt people. All right, fine. Don't go all blood rage on me. Or what? You'll tell the other matriarchs to order a hit. Hey, that's not gonna happen. Nazi and I were together for more than a century. You loved her? Of course I loved her. She was so smart. Always thinking. Nice, too. Hell of a lot nicer than I am. But damn, that rack. I mean, even before she hit the matriarch stage. You don't need to tell me everything. Listen to me when I said the Asari were stuck in the past. Only difference was I wanted us to stand on our own. She wanted alliances with the other species. Is that why? Why it ended? Nah. Well, maybe. I don't know. Mostly it ended because she wanted to solve things a smart way. I wanted to fight. Those aren't mutually exclusive. Yeah. I hear you've racked up quite a body count, but then, you are a quarter Krogan. Now you're doing it on purpose. It was pretty clear she was leaving. Can't be the wise counselor when you're married. Why not? Sex appeal. No species only pay attention if they want to have sex with you. So, you have to be available. Mysterious. What? That's not true. Shepard listens to me. <laughs> and you're single, aren't you? You think Shepard is... No. No. I made her promise to let you go your own way, though. No matter what she wanted. Really? I knew you'd be special, kid. Any daughter of hers. I told her, you're treating her like a baby bird, Nezzy. She's gonna raise one hell of a storm with those little wings. Little wing? You okay? Yes. Thanks. Better to remember her like this. And as whatever she turned into with that Saren bastard. It wasn't her fault. She was trying to stop Saren, guide him as a force of good. But she was indoctrinated. Look, I heard stories about the Reapers messing with your head. They're more than stories. I've seen it. Every Cerberus soldier is a Reaper slave. She fought it with every fiber of her being. She even broke free and helped Shepard on Novaria before she died. I was there. She said, I'd made her proud. All this time, I blame Nezzy for it. A thousand years old, and I still don't know crap. Thanks for telling me. Just 
take care of yourself out there. Okay, kid? I will, Dad. Hey. <clears throat> I've called a few friends. Commandos. Eclipse girls who uh, owe me some favors. They're all yours. Just tell them where to go. You're giving me a sorry commandos? Well, you're too old for me to buy you a damn pony. You're the best father a girl could wish for. for keeping an eye on you. I am not my mother. Mm, you did threaten to flay someone alive with your mind. I had to make them take me seriously. I wasn't going to actually do it. And... you bugged my office on Ilium. That'd be the logical conclusion. Yeah. Matriarchs aren't gonna do anything to you, especially in the middle of this damn war. My reports don't show much activity from the Asari military against the Reapers. Come on, you know how Asari work, infiltration and sabotage. But against Reaper forces, that's... I know, about as useful as tits on a Hanar. Good thing we've let the Turians and the Krogan do the heavy lifting. Our people just aren't built for the front ranks. 